you know, give me two hours and I'll give you 10 years back. A cure lift is my take on a full smash facelift that emphasizes quick recovery. I kind of do the parts of the smash facelift that I find that are essential. And so my take on it is, uh, you know, give me two hours and I'll give you 10 years back. So what things can a cure lift address? Uh, basically the same things as a smash facelift. As we get close to our fifth decade, our cheek pads descend and it makes it look like we've lost volume in our face. But we really haven't, it's always there. Uh, we just, it's in the wrong place. And we start developing jowls so we look hollow through the uh, lower face, but we look boxier and square. So this is just misplaced volume. And the whole idea is to put things back to where they were so that you look natural, look, you look like you did 10 years ago. The perfect candidate for a cure lift, I believe, is the 50 something year old woman who you look at her and you think, she looks pretty good. But she's starting to notice things, especially uh, early jowls and sagging when she bends her neck. Um, also, men too, of course. Uh, but these are people that just need a little tune up and want to look about 10 years younger. And this should last at least 10 years um, so that when you get to 60, you look pretty darn good. Cover fairly quickly. You'll be out and about in about a week running errands. Uh, maybe even sooner you might sneak out and get groceries. And by two weeks, even your family and friends aren't sure what's going on with you except that you look great. Well, there's a stereotype out there about facelift and it, I guess the procedure doesn't always have the best reputation because people think everyone looks really pulled tight and unnatural. Um, and that's a stereotype because I think it's true. Uh, and I don't think that should ever happen. Um, what we want to do is put structures back to where they were. So, uh, and once we do this, you're not gonna look any different than you did 10 years ago. Uh, there's, as I said, no reason to look um, unnaturally pulled. And so we concentrate a lot of our dissection uh, in the and surgery in the deeper tissues rather than just pulling on the skin, which is how you can look um, very unnatural.